The Ilana and Madeline Foundation was started up a few years ago uh, after Ilana and Madeline who were killed in the uh, Port Arthur massacre and the aim of the organisation is to keep uh, children safe from violence and bullying. Uh, with our relationship with Richmond Football Club, they've actually given of themselves and I mean from president to players. So they've built resources for our schools, for all our schools to access with really clear messages about our values and that is tremendous. Barangara Pathways Program is for students who are, have social and emotional problems and are disengaged from mainstream schools. So the Better Buddies program at Berengara is really to empower students who have probably felt like they haven't had power before. This is our second session out here at Berengara School now. In the first session we touched about ways to keep happy and we speak about uh, positivity, gratitude, mindfulness, kindness and exercise. And it was just such an overwhelming success in terms of the kids' engagement and their attendance that it's become a really important part of our curriculum and our program now. The kids look up to these uh, players as role models and they've got some really clear, straightforward messages. And, and so bullying is a, a massive issue in society, uh, especially in kids these days. And uh, that's highlighted by the disturbing fact that uh, we could fill the MCG uh, with the amount of kids that are bullied around Australia every fortnight. So I think that in itself highlights exactly why it's important we support um, what they're trying to achieve. They are actually showing kids the way forward and the players are giving of themselves again to show the, the, the kids about how their journey and how they got there, which is really, really important. And seeing the, the difference that it's made here at Berengara to students who struggled to speak up to start with and see the positive attitude in them uh, has been a real highlight of working here. They've heard the hardships that Steve has gone through and some of the challenges he had getting into his AFL career and I think they're really learning that it's just part of life and it's about how we deal with those hardships that kind of define us as a person. Everyone faces that adversity whether it be on a small scale or uh, a larger scale and to be able to arm these students with tools to help with dealing with that adversity uh, can certainly help with, their, with mental health. As part of AMF Match Day we're asking our supporters to donate one dollar per goal that we kick so we'll try and pile on the goals against the Blues and we hope that our supporters support the cause uh, for AMF and the Alana and Madeline Foundation.